Hi, my little bunnies, and thank you for watching. Um, I had a dear friend of mine ask me if I can show them how to um, copy and paste a clickable link into the description under your videos. Um, this specific person is using an iPad, and um, I know it's a little bit different when you use an iPad than it is when you use a computer and copy and paste, because with a computer, obviously, you just right-click your mouse and copy and paste. On an iPad, it's a little bit different, so rightfully so, if somebody doesn't understand how to do that. So, I'm here to show you how to do it. So, this is for her and also for anybody else who might want to learn how to do this on their iPad. So, obviously, I'm on my own YouTube page, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up another tab, and I'm going to type, just say, for instance, YouTube.com. Okay, and you see that's already up there, so I'm just going to... That never happens okay and I'm just going to hold down this here and you see that little bubble above my finger you can move that anywhere you want to but you want it to be right where you want to copy at because that's where it's gonna pick up from that link okay so as soon as you do that it'll show paste select all or select and I want to select all because I want that whole tab and then I'm going to push copy and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back into my YouTube channel page so I'm going to open that back up and then what I'm going to do is go to video manager now you can do this before you start editing your videos if you know there's a link that you're going to be using copy and paste it copy it first so that way what when you upload your videos you can put it directly into your description and you don't have to go to vid video editing and then go through that so now here is our description box <clears throat> now I'm going to show you how you paste this in there so you just click there of course you want to put a space bar between anything you might already have in there and then you just hold it down and you see once again that bubble is there and you want to make sure that it is exactly where you want it because it's going to paste where your where that bubble's at so I want it obviously in my description so I'm going to let go and then push paste and it pasted right there okay now anytime you want a clickable link it has to be an actual link it has to say dot com http or www dot or whatever it has to be a real link and when this shows up i'll show you right now i'm going to push save oh, sorry always make sure you save it as well because if you don't click save then it's not going to save what you did new okay so now we're going to go back to my channel and soon as this hurries up because it wants to run slow just because I'm doing something and I'm going to go back to video manager again come on there we go and I'm going to go back to that same video that I did that to so that way I can show you in the description I'm going to push down the description and you see right there it says youtube.com and you see how it's highlighted blue that lets you know that it's clickable if it was just the same color as the rest of the writing in my description then it's not a clickable link that doesn't mean that somebody can't just spell it out their self in the search bar which is up here and then just do it man manually but if you want them to be able to actually click on it right through your description you want to make sure that it highlights blue or they can't do that and as I said you want to make sure that it is a real link something that says dot com or www you know a real link okay and now it says that there and watch when I click on it YouTube page will open up so it opened up to a whole nother YouTube page okay so that lets you know that I saved it I copied and pasted it I saved it and now it's there okay so that is that now if you want to delete that what you'll have to do is you'll just delete oops and then you push save again to make sure it saves that you got it out of there okay so that's going to be everything that's everything that you do now i'm going to do this one more time so that way you guys get it so what you do is I'm going to go to an open page, just a web page, and I'm going to click in here Facebook. So right now, Facebook.com showed up there. And what you're going to do is hold it down till you see that bubble. Make sure it's right on top of there. Let go. 
select all copy go back to your YouTube if you're uploading a video just make sure you already do that before you upload your video that way you already have it copied and then you can just drop it in your description when you're as you're editing when you go to edit your video so now we're gonna go back to um, sorry we're gonna go back to my description but first I got to go to video manager because obviously I'm editing again and I got to click edit And then I'm going to go ahead and click on my description. And as you see, that little blinking thing is letting me know that I can write in here. So I'm going to hold it down. The bubble's there. It's where I want it. I'm going to let go, paste, and it's there. So push save, always save. And then we're going to go back. And now we're going to just take a look and make sure that that went there. Okay. So as you see, it says facebook.com, it's blue, clickable link. I'm opening it up now, okay? So that is my Facebook, personal Facebook, that may be. <laughs> okay. So now we're going to go back there, okay? So I hope you guys understood what I was trying to say. If I explain it too fast, I can always slow it down and do it again, but that is basically what you do. It's just as simple as holding down that link, copying, and then select all, copy, paste, blah, 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 okay? It's just that simple, and that's with any link. So if just say, for instance, if you want a link of your own channel, <clears throat> you'll go back, let me make sure I'm in desktop mode. Sorry. I am in desktop mode. Um, so what I'll do is just say I go to hmm, my video. So I'll go to my channel. And that right there is my link to my channel to my actual channel if you want the link to just your video so when somebody goes on there it's just your videos then what you do is you'll click video and then you'll click the top and your thing will show up right here so then you just hold it down just like you did everything else select all oops sorry copy and then you'll do this. So now I'm gonna go back to a home, a home page and I'm gonna show you how my, that's my page. So I'm gonna hold this down, oh, sorry. Hold it down, let go, paste, push go, and it's gonna bring me right to my, my video, see? Now all of my videos on there. So I actually copied the link to my videos. There's a link to everything. There's a link to your channel, there's a link to your videos, and this is the link to my video. So now all of my videos are showing up on here. And if I did the link to my channel, just sort of, um, if I did the link to my actual channel, it would be like this. my channel now this is this will be the difference select all copy I'm gonna go back to the blank page let go uh oh I'm not holding it down properly there it goes paste go and now this is actually the difference this is my channel. So it's showing everything on my channel, not just my videos. Okay. So there's a link to everything that you do. So I hope you guys understand that. I hope I explained it clearly. And I want to thank you guys for watching and I hope y'all got it. Talk to y'all soon. Bye-bye.